It's 5 a.m. in the morning in Brussels and I'm going to Prague. Here I am in Brussels in the car going to pick up my friend and then heading to the airport to fly to Prague where we're going to attend the final of the Europa Conference League 2023 between Fiorentina and West Ham. Okay, I should have explained this part first. I'll be very quick. I'm a huge Fiorentina supporter since I was a child. In fact, as a child who got into football since the early ages, I had to identify myself with a football club that somehow represented myself with my friends and peers. And it was easy to relate to Cagliari, my hometown's football club, which I still love to date. But since many other children in Italy were rooting for somehow more successful Italian clubs, I started looking for a team which I could find some connection with. Now, in life I always refused the conventional easy routes, so I refused supporting the traditional Italian successful clubs. In addition, since I used to go to Florence, a city I always loved for family reasons, at one point I started following Fiorentina. But it wasn't before an Argentinian striker named Gabriel Omar Batistuta joined the club that I ended up becoming a sick supporter. Since then, my life as a football fan has been always entrenched with Fiorentina, and my passion has grown year after year. But let's go back to Prague now. We're in Prague and West Ham supporters are definitely outnumbering us. Match day today in Prague, it's 7th of June 2023 and uh, tonight Fiorentina will face West Ham in the final of the Conference League. We're getting ready, I'm heading for breakfast, yesterday we hang out a bit, we met also some West Ham supporters, it's crazy, there's 30,000 West Ham supporters, we could only find a couple of Fiorentina supporters, so they definitely outnumber us, hopefully they're all peaceful because if things get hot then it's not looking good for us. But uh, yeah, I'm getting excited. I'm here with my Batistuta and Fiorentina jersey from 1996-1997. Piece of uh, art, I would say. And uh, getting excited and stressed out at the same time. So let's see how it goes. So strolling through Prague's beautiful city center, heading for lunch soon and uh, tension is mounting. Tension is mounting and uh, what I was thinking is for Fiorentina today is more than historical. We've been in our last uh, European Cups final okay, yeah. in 1990, we lost to Juventus and our last win in a European competition dates back to 1975. So yeah. I guess that by the afternoon uh, people uh, will get more and more tense and uh, yeah, let's hope to enjoy it as much as possible. It's crazy how many West Ham supporters are here. It's literally, we are definitely outnumbered. They sing Viva Lazio, thinking that uh, we get offended by that. Actually, we don't give, much, we don't, we don't care much about it. <laughs> Bubbles on fire.
Only West Ham supporters. It's time. It's time to head to the stadium. People are coming to the stadium. Here we are. Fiorentina fan zone. Ready to get in. And now I can see the purple stain. I can. We just got in. Watch it. 
buono, 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 buono! Oh! Vienna Airport, going back to Brussels. I recovered today. I really had a rough night. Uh, I was empty at the end of the match yesterday. It was really disappointing, really sad. Uh, I think I cried for the first time uh, for a football match. But yeah, I mean, that's life. And in the end, uh, I can only say it was a beautiful experience. 
that I will always remember. Disappointment, but at the same time, uh, my heart is full of uh, good memories.